Hey yo, what is up YouTube? It's your boy. You boy! You boy! Today, I got myself a pair of wireless headphones. These are the Jepson M1 Bluetooth wireless headphones. Which you can see, I got them for the low, low price of 350 bucks at Cash Crusaders here in Kruenstadt. I don't know if they're available in other things because you know because you never technically know if Cash Crusaders has like the same product all around and stuff. But in any case, these are my new Bluetooth headphones and let's just get them out the box. Mm. Mm. Here we go. Damn, these actually feel really great. Like they legit, this is actually like good quality headphones guys, like I'm not, I'm not lying to you right now, like this is legit great quality headphones, like they feel really great, they feel really premium in the hand, like even this part, these uh, sidebar, side panels, they feel like, you can tell that it's made out of plastic, but it's almost, ha it has like a matte finish to it. So they are really not slippery, they won't gather any fingerprints. Oh, and there's that one button on the side. Uh, micro USB port. So you can charge these. And as you can notice, there's no um, aux 3mm jack point. So all you get out of this is uh, the wireless Bluetooth headset. And you can't even, you can't plug these in once your battery dies. So if it's dead, it's dead. So that's kind of a downside, but these actually really actually feel great guys like I'm, I'm not kidding like these feel really premium the cushions feel soft as you can see right here so they will be like really comfortable on your ears but these are like really really nice so in the so in the box we also get the charging cable which basically that's I mean standard so it's just a micro USB standard, so it's pretty much just a micro USB cable, nothing special. So, like, really, like, I don't, I don't know what else to say about these guys. Like, these just feel really great in the hand. Like, they really, really feel good in the hand. It's like it's not even like cheap sets of uh, Bluetooth headphones. I w if if I had to make a guess, I think they would retail normally. If these were like Sony's or something like very expensive, they would retail for like maybe 700 just because of the way they feel. But yeah, let's go test them out. Now to list some of the features for these headphones. They are obviously Bluetooth headphones. They charge with a USB cable. They're compatible with both Android and iPhone, PC, as long as the PC is obviously Bluetooth enabled. I mean, you can't really connect it to a PC unless you have like a Bluetooth dongle so but for laptop users you're pretty much set they also operate within 10 meters or in range so you could probably like leave your phone in the kitchen and then walk to your room depending on how big your house is and then you can still hear your music we should really just test them out now so how you turn these on is that you actually have to hold this button in for six seconds and then a blue light will emit and obviously if you want to turn it off you do the exact same thing you hold this in for six seconds and then bow it will look exactly like this with no light emitting from it now to connect these to your phone there will be a blue and red light that will flash alternatively once these are on and that will indicate that the device is on and it's very it's ready to pair with a device basically then you would go to your phone go to bluetooth settings go check out their devices and a new device should appear at, with the name M1BT. That would be these bad boys. Now, once you've selected the name on your phone, the blue LED will stop flickering and it will just be like a bright blue color. And that's when you know that the device is successfully connected. But the nice feature about this is, is that if you've already paired these Bluetooth headphones with a phone previously, then you could just like turn them on within range of the phone and it will, they will automatically connect. So that's a plus for them. And one thing they also add is that if you don't use the Bluetooth headphones within 10 minutes of turning them on, they basically go into like a power saving mode where they turn off ba basically just to like save your power. So because I mean, it's only a 300 milliamp battery. So it sounds, seems like a nice feature to add to this. 
I wish they actually had like uh, the other buttons so you could like skip tracks and rewind stuff like that so yeah that's it for these headphones if you like them I might just link them down in the description so you can get a pair for yourself sound quality is pretty decent at most the bass isn't really that punchy but they sound great overall and if you like this video please like subscribe here and hit the notification bell so you can be notified next time i post a video and i'll check on the next one now alternatively and then you, that will it, it will be. now to now con to uh, now to connect to uh, oh my god what is happening